How to process time-lapse photography next. Hello, my name is Doug Hubble and welcome to Astrophotography Tutorials. Today I'm going to show you how to take your time-lapse photos and put them together into a movie. This is a very quick way to process your JPG images if you capture your images in JPG for your time-lapse. Now there is another way of uh, processing your images if you capture your images in raw format, but this is a daytime time lapse and I wanted to show you how easy it is just to use Windows Movie Maker. So the first thing you need to do is you need to add your, your photos to it. So click on Add Videos and Photos. Go to the directory where you have your images stored. Click one of them, then con hit, click Control A, select them all, and open them. And what it will do is it will open all of your images inside here. The one thing that you'll notice is that by default, each frame is brought into Windows Movie Maker as a seven second duration. And you cannot make a, an effective time lapse photo at that rate. You can see right now it's a, a pretty long uh, video. But if I select the first image, then press Control A, so I'm selecting all of the images at once, then click on the Edit and go to the duration and let's change that to 0 0.06 you can play around with the duration to your uh, best satisfaction that you would like and then now you can uh, kind of preview it and here in this window you just press the play button and you can kind of see it going through its uh, animation there uh, what I'm going to do next on this example too is I'll show you I'm just going to add some uh, music you can add music to it if you uh, wanted to do that go back to the home tab and then add music click click that button and just select a, uh, a music file uh, Kevin McLeod is a, uh, a very good musician that allows you to use his music for free so if you're making a video and putting it on YouTube you could just uh, use one of his music uh, selections there's quite a, a great big library there click that and press open and then it's going to go ahead and put the music track in there. One of the things you might want to do also is at the end of the movie you can put a, 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 a fade in it. So if you click on it on the music title, under the music tools click options and then fade out you can say uh, fade out slow. Now that you've got your video all put together the way you want it then what you can do is click here and go to save movie. I like to use high definition and you click on that and then just save your movie and go ahead and let it compile. I know there's a lot of uh, creative and talented people that watch here and if you would please post your suggestions or comments on how to better improve time-lapse photography please do in the comments section below. If this is your first time watching I would like you to subscribe. I publish two astrophotography videos on the 1st and 15th of every month. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon.